Welcome back. I know we've been away for a little while, but between family emergencies and just a very bad strep throat that had us lose our voices completely, we have been healing both mentally and physically for a little while. So we thank you for your patience, but it is time. It is time for the renovation boat tour. We have spent months and months on so many different projects all around the boat that we wanted to show off 95% of the work that has been done, there's always something left over on a project and I think any homeowner or boat owner can attest to that. So let's jump right in. On this corner, we had originally a nav station. So there was a table and a chair here that nobody could fit into. So we have turned that into a full counter space. We usually have more counter space, but our beautiful Christmas tree is here for the holidays. It is where we prep our stations. We have a trivet that we can put hot food on. We have all the fresh vegetables and the piece de resistance is our beautiful Dometic freezer, which does slide out right here. And you can open up everything to your heart's content. It opens up all the way, take my word for it. And then it locks into place and it doesn't come back so that is amazing for us. Yes, the stove still gimbals. Yes, the oven still opens. I know a lot of people were worried about that. But speaking of which, let's go to the countertop. So we have done an epoxy marble countertop all over here and these two countertops as well. It has come out beautifully. It is shiny, it is gorgeous and it is very, very usable. We have used this to cook now for several, several weeks and it's been amazing. Our hugely proud product here is our new beautiful big, big, big sink. I think I could probably climb in there. I try to. Um, and our beautiful um, faucet, soap dispenser, our Acuva, and something that I don't think that we spent a lot of time in any of our videos showing off is our, let me move this out of the way for now, our beautiful backsplash. And it is, I'm gonna come the other side. So stay there, stay right there. Okay, because I didn't want to be in the way. So this beautiful backsplash is real tile, but it is very versatile, it's very tough, it should hang about and we absolutely love it because I think it makes this more like a regular kitchen along with this ginormous sink and it's just oh it's a little gem and it's the first thing you see when you come down into our boat so we feel like this is the most important it's it's our foyer it is our <laughs> grand staircase it is our you know most proudest project we've done we're not done yet if you come on over here, you will see this beautiful walnut finish fridge door. Our fridge door originally matched this and it was level, but it cracked. And because it cracked, we had to scrap the whole thing and make an entire fridge door out of scratch. So we have done just that. All this is insulated inside with foam and it is a beautiful, matching somewhat um, fridge door. So we made our own fridge door and keeps all of our things very, very warm. We put in new um, gaskets so that it really keeps it. And this weighs about, I would say 15, 20 pounds. So when it closes, it is sealed and it is amazing. So let's keep going. All right, so Something that is very important to us is where we sit and where we hang out and where we work. So these cushions, I'm gonna take one out. I wanna show it to you. We made these cushions. These are, I'm gonna risk opening one of these. These are three inch, um, I should never risk opening one of these. We're gonna, we're gonna pretend I opened one of these. These are three inch firm um, foam with two inch additional gel memory foam, all wrapped up in Dacron filling and sewn up by us. And they are gloriously comfortable to sit on. 
for hours and hours and hours on end. Yes, we plan to do that with these in the future. Didn't get to them, but a project for the future. And you will see an addition to Turtle, a brand new comfy, comfy, comfy ottoman. Ignore the sale right, it will go away. But it brings us to our little computer center pouch here. And if you drop the table down, our beautiful monitor that does come out and that we can get a lot of work done very comfortably. We've got all the attachments and accoutrements in the pocket that you saw. And it is amazing. And we've also had lots of movie nights where we, my feet are dirty. So <laughs> where we've had amazing, amazing nights. Oh, so, <laughs> so you know that these are not like super professionally made because if you notice, I made these so sealed that if the zipper is closed, the air doesn't escape or it does it in a very, um, in a very, very interesting way. Let's put it that way. So I need to open the zipper up a little bit or put little vents in there. Let's keep going. So this is our uh, main berth, front berth with a Pullman bed. And I have to show you our pride, pride in this room is this bed. So if I, I can't show it to you because it's all encased, but basically if you see this nine inches of uh, foam here, it's four inches of firm, three inches of latex, and another two inches of gel memory foam that makes up this nine inch bed, which make this, along with this comfy, comfy, comfy comforter, a cloud. Only negative thing is that I can't really get into it. So I need, I need a little, I need a little assistance. Ah. But I made it. I have had enough short jokes. I don't need any more. So keep that to yourself. I want to show you while we're here something that we're going to go into in much more detail on a very exciting segment that's coming up early next year, which is Medical Mondays. It is our medical kit. So as a physician, it's very, very important to me that we stay safe on this boat, but I also have all the tools I need to help us in an emergency and all the tools Dave needs to help me in an emergency. So we have all of our medical kit here, easy to grab, all labeled, all organized, and we'll go into super detail about that on a very special episode in a very special series, which we're very, very excited about. Did I say we're very excited? Oh yeah, something small. Oh, 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 I forgot. I almost forgot this. Don't we look so cute? This is from Japan. But we're very much a fall asleep watching the laptop, Netflix, YouTube thing. So when you're ready, you take this beautiful picture off. Usually comes off easier. There we go. And ta-da! We have a laptop stand that we can watch all of our movies in and when we're done we put the velcro back which i may need to redo there we go and we're all done the last but certainly not least update that we made in this boat and actually i should tell you the one of the biggest upgrades we've made on this boat you can't actually see you see some remnants of it that we need to put away still, but it, are, it is this. It is a complete overhaul of our freshwater system. We have ripped out every single piece of freshwater plumbing in this boat and exchanged it out for PEX and new manifolds from freshwater systems. We will put these all away. <laughs> the insulated ones are the reds and the blues are the coals that pull the cold water up and they have worked beautifully. You can see our beautiful, beautiful sink here and our beautiful new faucet, our beautiful new toilet with brand new plumbing running into it. So da da, can't really see anything more than that. It's a, it's a toilet, but it's really, really, really comfortable. It's the rare and elegance and it's, oh, Dave fell down. He's okay though. 
Uh, <laughs> see, that bed is way too high. <laughs> but um, it's the rare and elegance, and it's really, really nice. And in here is our shower. We haven't quite finished in here yet, but you will see that our washing machine does live in here, which we do plan on installing in a, on a more permanent basis. But that is almost all the renovations that we've done on this boat. And we're gonna go and see this one last thing. I promise, last thing. Oh. But it is one of the most exciting things. Well, they're all really exciting. Is this aft um, head. So before, this was our storage unit. This was where we shoved everything, all the toilet paper, everything, paper towels, things that we didn't know what to do with all went in here. But now we have changed this into our wet locker. So if you come over and look, and I'm gonna duck down, we have installed dowels. We have installed a shelf, which we will veneer later on. And we have space to hang any wet fowlies all of our BCDs and regulators. We've got our, all of our fins and everything in here, all of our booties and our Mantis dive compressor. And if you're like, okay, so that's almost everything. Where's your dive tanks? Come back. So this used to be an ode to the 90s, I would say almost sexist slightly sexist matter of a vanity that was here but I joke I joke there was a chair here that we removed you could use it for anything but a vanity but there's a mirror and a table here so we're gonna we're gonna pretend that that's not a vanity are our tanks so we've attached them here nice and secure and they're not going anywhere and there's a little baby guy that we're gonna use to clean um, the bottom of the boat but he's also going to get strapped on here we just have to go buy the ratchet straps but that is it. Oh, that's it. I'm too old to be on my knees. Oh. Welcome to the newly renovated turtle. We have so many more projects we're excited about, but all that is going to wait because tune in next week. We are getting ready to jump to the Bahamas and it is going to be incredible. And have a nice day. See you soon.